hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. And since last time I did go ahead and grind for the uh, Drill Arm 1s, getting all four of them, that actually took uh, a little bit, maybe like an hour or so. And I ended up replacing the uh, Vulcans that were in the decode. So we have a little bit more chip code consistency. If you're not playing the, uh, or I should say, if you are playing the Team Proto Man version, don't worry about this as much. Um, but for Team Kernel version, which we are playing, this could be really useful just because, uh, semi spoiler warning, although I've kind of already said it before, but we're going to be getting the. Uh, a double soul that uses the break chips and that uses wood chips, so the J code here could become useful for a while. Alright, and with that, we are here at Nightman. Oh, yeah, also, I have a ton of money from all the grinding we did off camera, too, so we can pick up a few unlockers. I know we've got a couple of places to go for those. Stop this drill! Grrr! Nightman, stop that drill! Grrr! He's not listening. Yeah, guess what? We're gonna have to fight him. It's the only way to save Land's friends. Grrr! Grrr! I don't mind the, uh, script here for... You know, the whole plot set up for why we have to fight Nightman and how he's kind of not under control. This is a decent start. Okay, I'm gonna start with the area grab. I still like having that preset here, especially since those drill arms are going to be going uh, to places. Uh, let's start with the Cacti Ball and Drill Arm. This might actually come close to killing him. Yeah, I guess not. Oh, there's our... Oh, hey, this will kill him. Because that's 380 damage. Yeah, I made that Nightman battle look easy. If the battle goes long enough, he will hop forward one square, which will... I believe it will also crack some of your panels, if not all of them. Maybe the higher level he is, or higher versions he is, it will crack the whole thing. But anyways, uh, with that, we snap Nightman out of the control of the Magno Metal. The drill has been deactivated. So this was a way that they were able to write this whole scenario where we still had to battle Nightman and, and stop something, but Nightman doesn't come off as really the bad guy. Neither does Princess Bride. Alright, now we gotta go finish finding our friends. In this weird convoluted mine. Hey, there they are. Oh good, they're all still safe. Uh, do we have another virus battle here? Oh no, this is an actual jack-in sequence. Okay. We can do that. Hello there, Mr. Program. Well, you're not helpful to stopping this. Uh, I want to find the mystery data before we stop this. I, I mean, our friends have been waiting for four drills to be shut down. They can wait a little while longer. Cacti Ball! 
Yeah, so the drill arms, they will launch out uh, two squares forward just like a long sword. But they will also... where's my mystery data? There's no mystery data in here? That's a ripoff. Uh, but they will also push an enemy back, so if an enemy is like the at the square directly in front of you, you could actually end up hitting him Uh, you could end up hitting him for... A Hang on. Uh, you could end up getting, like, more than two hits off of him. Because the first hit, it will also push the enemy back. And so if they're in the front, you could actually hit him twice, and then it spins. And, uh... Yeah, you could get, like, three, four, maybe even five hits with it can be quite a strong chip. Um, problems. We push the big button. Oh, and there's Nightman here to protect us. Because we triggered that uh, trap. Obviously, if you were playing the Team Proto Man version, it would be um, Magnet Man that shows up here, and he has like this magnet barrier thing that he would use in this cutscene. Now we're even. The electronic lock is down. You can save your friends. Yay! Alright, I guess I'll save them. do it land thank you I thought we were in for it I don't want to stay here another minute the rock foundation is trembling hurry outside everybody uh, I don't know why they need to rush I mean, yeah, there was the minor tremor and whatnot, but you can actually come back to this area later. There's actually going to be a lot of stuff to find throughout the mines as this game goes on. But we don't need to worry about that right now. Hey, it's Barrel. We're planning another attack on ACDC area. We must nip Nebula's plans in the bud. We still don't have a strategy for the gun battery. On Oran Area 1, but we have no choice except to proceed. You have no strategy, so how do you plan to do that? Begin mission immediately. Head to Oran Area 1 now. We need to guard against it. Yeah, he figured it out. What on earth is it? The net's occupied by a group called Nebula. I belong to a team whose job is to free areas under Nebula control. I'm going into battle with Nebula forces, but I can't succeed without Nightman's help. Yes, I see. We'd be happy to help, right, Nightman? Yes, um. If it will be of any help at all, don't hesitate to call upon Nightman. I owe you one. Everybody, or an area one. Let's hurry to the net. Ignore our friends that have been in trauma the past several episodes. Oh, wait. Ah, you're welcome, Mr. Uh, Underwear Houdini. You don't know if you can walk yet? You just walked all the way out of the mine. You're still standing. What? It, whatever. So that part is happy. Now I guess we can jack in here. Although... Maybe I should go grab... I'm gonna go grab a few... 
Can I even do that? Can I even leave here? Well, not this way. Let's swim back across the uh, ocean. Okay, we cannot actually leave here yet. So, yeah. Uh, I was going to get some unlockers because I think there's a purple mystery data in one of these Orin areas that we were unable to get earlier. But oh well. Oh, we don't want to go that way. I could pick up the Guardian chip since we have so much extra stuff. Oh, I want to get that. But this chip setup is atrocious for getting that. And uh, we're just going to not use these. Oh, hang on. Oh, I... Grr. Cacti balls! Actually, I should use the drill arm, because it can't reach the... Uh, what's-his-face back there. There we go, and can I get more... Yeah, that's what I need right now. I, I, I should not complain about 1500 Zenny. There's the unlocker. Yup, 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 yup. Where's, where's the green mystery data around here? I need that too. My idea here is to take out the Met in one shot. And I think our chip folder should be good enough for uh, this thing. Oh, triple crack. I don't need that. Cacti balls. We like these. And I like the drill arm chips. It's nice to have them here and have them in the same code. Oh, this place is open now that we uh, unlocked it in the real world. There's a reg up one. Those are always useful. Ah, I'm still good with the area grab as being preset. At least for the time being. And there's Crack Bomb V. Those aren't horrible chips to be using either. Holy Panel Star. Huh. This might be the earliest point in a Bail Network game where we've gotten that, uh. where we've gotten the Holy Panel chip. Nice double delete there. And a mark cannon that we already have a bunch of copies of. Alright. I don't think the holy panel chip is super useful. Airspin one in the E code. Oh, we do need to recover 80s. I shouldn't need them for right now. There's the Guardian. Oh, I could buy... I'm just going to buy a single HP memory. We can afford it. But I want to hold on to the rest of our money for the time being. And hopefully this can be... this can be more money, or it can be an air hockey S. 
More money. I'm good with that. Okay, we're gonna drop a save here. And we're gonna go in and we're gonna start this liberation mission, but first we have to get past this barrier. I think I know a way we can beat the gun battery. Is that so? And Nightman just said, why can't we just teleport to whatever spot we want to on the internet? Uh, we don't have the power of cutscenes. I guess that's why. Nightman, Princess Pride's nip. How did you know that? Quite a surprise. Let's see what you've got then. Certainly, I won't disappoint you. Nightman, let's go. Nightman, proceed on my signal. I'll destroy the gun battery while you're absorbing hits. Here goes. Three, two, one, begin. Now, screen divide. Hey, that worked. I like that too because it was also teamwork. Those shots were but pebbles to my hide. I've been waiting for a nice adventure. Alrighty, well, you heard him. Yep, let's get in there. It should automatically restore us to full health at the start of this. Yeah, it does. This area is controlled by the Dark Lloyds. That guy! <gasps> it's Shade Man! Returning from Battle Network 4. He does not do the thing he did in Battle Network 4 where he splits into four bats anytime you hit him. Uh, no, there's none of that. He, he fights like a normal Navi now. Long time no see, Mega Man. Hehe. <laughs> the Dark Power has resurrected me. Well, we'll have to fix that, won't we? He's the one who spread dark chips. Get him! Watch out for his flying capability. It lets him attack from any direction during the Dark Lloyd's phase. So we'll be getting hit all the time? No, we have a Navi with good defense abilities. I'll shield all of you from the enemy attack. You can count on him. Now let's do it. Complete the liberation within nine phases. Alright, now uh, let me grab the map for this thing. Alright, we do have data spot. Ooh, there's a battle chip we definitely gotta get here. Uh, so let's take a look. I kind of want to use... Actually, if we use Colonel there as a screen divide, we could do that. Yeah, that's my usual strategy, because then we get this, which is, that is a battle chip, and it just kind of lets us open up into this whole area. Uh, we'll have to get that dark hole. What is that? That is a battle chip as well. Uh, we'll need it for our collection. I'll probably pick it up here, just to show you guys what it is. But if you're trying to get, uh, like, say, if we get it, if we get this within six or seven turns, we get the Shade Man SP chip. Uh, eight or nine turns, you get Shade Man, and ten turns plus, you'll get 2,000 Zenny. So, yeah, we have never work cut out for us. Lots of stuff to liberate here. But we do not want to start with Uh, no, we want to start with Nightman. Nightman on this one, we just need this panel liberated. And he has a Night Crusher. Throw an Iron Ball directly ahead. It's actually kind of useful. I don't think we're going to get a one turn with this. Oh, I didn't realize we were back. 
I should have probably realized it. Uh, all the other navvies you get are just going to have, like, this dinky little pea shooter thing. He'll, ha he'll have his own charge attack, but it's a... he just swings his night ball around. It does... it does a lot of damage, I think. I don't remember how much damage it does, and it might change... I think it increases, like, as the game goes on, maybe? I don't know. Uh, but I know it does a lot of damage. It makes Nightman pretty good if you're surrounded, like, on both sides. If I knew, if I had a good enough folder and was confident about getting a one-turn liberation, you could save a uh, order point here. But I don't think it'll be necessary to do that. Okay, I just need those drills to come down. Oh, how about that? I still got the one-turn liberation anyways. Oh, we did get the panel behind us. That we didn't really need to get. And we get more order points there, even though it's only two. Alright, now Mega Man's turn. If Mega Man longswords here, again, it won't matter if we get, you know, these couple panels or not. But that puts us right in line to get this uh, bonus panel next turn. I think that's my general strategy. We don't necessarily need to kill that guy. That thing way over there is order points, and you're going to spend a lot just trying to get to it, so I recommend ignoring it. Yeah, I'm looking at a map that tells me what all this stuff is. I do not have all this uh, memorized. But we're going to use order points here. We're going to... do this. Now we still get a one turn liberate. Oh, that's pretty nice. And we get a battle chip for high cannon DL. Oh, okay. I was misreading where, which battle chip was the where. Whatever. Hee hee hee, let's party. Okay, it doesn't really matter who liberates that bonus panel. We do want to get that, however. And we need to get into there. Um, I'm going to screen divide right here as Colonel, and hopefully if we get a one-turn liberation, then we can come down here. That's going to be the uh, general plan. So let's be Colonel. We'll let him liberate this. Once again, I wish bonus panel I could just... Okay. That's not bad. And I would rather do it this way, because I would rather take out the... Um, that dark hole this turn. If we get a one-turn liberation here, it's going to be tricky, because we're going to be, yeah, kind of cornered. Definitely more than possible with this. Watch this. Oh, he... Okay, so did not quite get the one turn. I, I misread which Met was going to attack first. I thought the one in the middle was going to attack first. That's why I moved down. If it weren't for that, I could have uh, could have gotten it because I would have copied the damage onto the cacti ball guy. But it's okay that it didn't happen that way. Uh, I'm definitely gonna take Nightman here because we're gonna be a little bit surrounded. We want to get rid of this dark hole. Oh, we also have one turn invincible, so I really don't know what I was worried about there. Um. Grab some space there. I'll show you what we're going to do with it. 
wanted to get rid of him. Oh, that's not... I wanted to do that. Okay. Yeah, look at that damage. 80 damage. Oh, you... Stop it. And his Wrecking Ball is why he's kind of good to have here. Or good for those uh, pincer attacks. I'm going to just ignore that bird. We don't need to kill it if we don't have to. Uh, that is an HP panel. Which means I'm not super interested in getting that with Mega Man. There's a bonus panel over there. Once again, the issue I have with the bonus panels is I can't just select which type of bonus I want. And there's certain battle chips, I don't know which what battle chips they are, there's another bonus panel, uh, that are just kind of locked away in those in those things. Uh, so I'm going to liberate this. I'll have Nightman get the healing, I think. Both gonna come down. Might get a one turn here. Okay, well, now we're definitely not. It just barely didn't get it, but it didn't really matter if we did or didn't. Dark Lloyd phase. You can see Shade Man has 600 health, and he can come in and attack, but that, uh, yeah, he can teleport to anywhere on the screen and attack. He'll randomly attack your party members. Oh. But if Nightman is close enough to them, Nightman will just swoop in and block. I believe it's just, yeah, he's only one panel away. Uh, this is a battle chip that we definitely want to get, so let's longsword that. This was designed for Mega Man to get. We don't have things on a good line, but I don't particularly care about that. Because we don't need to get a one turn liberation here. It's, it's not necessary. And the battle chip we get is. Air hockey in the R code. Yeah, uh, we might not want. We might want to repeat this scenario a few times to get a full set of those. I will do that sometime off camera. Also to get whatever Shade Man chip we don't get here. Once again, the enemies aren't in a line with each other. I could potentially... Yeah, see how I kind of pushed him back there? I don't know why I'm doing that. That's... That's a, that's a waste. It doesn't really matter. Uh, actually, let's do this. So we can do that. We can do that. And we liberated that, and we got a heart. So Nightman goes back to full health. Um, huh. If we kill that thing, it's just going to come back. What is in... Oh, that panel has more order points, so we're going to want to do that anyways. Oh, and I have a certain combination that... I want to do for this stretch. You want to do uh, 
Yeah, if you do a long sword here with Mega Man and then a screen divide here with Colonel, then you get access to both of those dark holes immediately, which is what we want to be doing. Uh, but to do any of that, we need... We do need order points. That's going to be rough. Uh, I guess... I mean, I could have Colonel take this on. Regardless, this setup is... It, it takes at least two Navi turns to get through here. I do want to go that way and get the other bonus panel. But I'm using three turns. I could potentially end up using three turns on this. But that's... Okay, I guess. It's not, but it is... It, it is what it is. Let's fight this thing. Okay, swords are kind of good against him because he likes to come in. But I can also just use that. Okay, didn't get the one turn kill there, but we don't really need it there. And now Shade Man is going to get a hit. That means that bird isn't going to hit us, too, uh, during their phase. Yeah, 60 damage. Alright, player phase. Ideally... Nightman can one turn this and we get order points, because we do need more order points. I'll come back into that bonus panel a little bit later. Let's see if we can pull this off. Uh, it's not going to be easy to pull off. I might actually be able to. Oh, darn it. I thought I was going to have one more spot and I could just do that to, uh, to him. Well, it's a good thing I didn't start out by selecting the, uh, wide sword, because I almost did that, too. Okay, well... I mean, we got to get those order points. What, what phase are we on? Phase four. Yeah, this isn't going the most ideal. You need to get more one-turn liberations. Let's do this, because we're going to put a longsword here. Although Mega Man is going to get attacked next by Shade Man, so maybe I should have went for the order points with him. That can one-shot the Cacti Ball. Okay. The other thing is we're not one-shotting this stuff, and that's okay. Uh, we don't necessarily need a one-turn kill here. Oh my goodness, I just kind of realized we're on overtime. Uh, Alright, let's liberate this right now. And then we'll go through the Dark Lloyd phase and then we'll end things off and... Uh, wrap up this whole ordeal next time.
guess this is the best we can do here. I did not quite have a full charge. Ooh, roll. Because that will also restore his health, which... Uh, he could use health for restoration. Dark Lloyd phase. Oh no, he chose to hit Nightman again, foolishly. Well, that's going to hit Mega Man, but that's only... is it 20 damage? 40? Okay, 20. And yeah, that's going to spawn another thing. Alright, player phase 5. Uh, so what's in this bonus panel? Well, we'll find that out next time.